Okay, another demonstration. This is now a uh, test stand of our uh, 12 kilowatt charger. And it's a little bit uh, Frankenstein looking because it's got actually two chargers in it and everything is exploded because um, we uh, test various versions of the boards and all those things on this so it's very open and actually um, the contents of it once uh, reduced to just one unit they fit into a 10 by 10 by 8 inch box standard box in front of it we have a Chatimo controller that's based on the Arduino Duo and uh, as you probably could guess, this is going to be a demonstration of charging a Nissan Leaf through a Chatima port. Uh, let's look at the car. So here's a car side setup. It's a beautiful 3D printed plug with some uh, custom made, handmade power pins and uh, signal pins. Um, our fellow collaborator Joel makes these beautiful plugs and uh, we're now um, trying to figure out how to scale the production with him. Let's go back to the uh, setup and try to power it up. By the way, we haven't talked about the source of power for this particular demonstration. We already have a demonstration of um, Chatima charging from uh, 240 volts uh, AC source single phase so this demonstration is pretty unusual as we charge from another vehicle specifically it's a RAV4 2013 uh, EV of course with a 41 kilowatt hour battery and let's look at the car here's a RAV again the uh, battery axis through the inverter, actually under all this hardware on the driver side front wheel well, brought out this 175 amp connector with uh, one zero gauge wires and it goes out and into that charger that you just saw. So what we'll try to do in a minute, we'll try to charge a leaf from a wrap. See what happens. Okay, we got access to the battery. It's at 395 volts right now. We're pushing 30 amps into it. This is pretty cool. This is the uh, CAN bus information stream and a couple of listings of the programs on the screen. So on the left, you see partially hidden behind the, um, the scrolling lines uh, is a actual QC code which takes care of the communication with the car and on the right side here is our um, charger code hardware running the um, pulse width modulation and all those things uh, rewritten for this purpose so again already 397 28 amps so um, in this particular run uh, we're limiting the power by well, actually the car is limiting the power you can see how it's ramping down it's 24 25 amps so this is just uh, commands going from the car and saying hey throttle down 22 amps we probably need to discharge the car a little bit before we um, uh, try to uh, crank it up to um, 15 or 20 kilowatts. Um, this particular unit uh, had its power limitation removed and it can go up to 20 kilowatts of power, which would be a recharge of a leaf at about maybe three quarters of a mile per minute maybe even uh, as close to a mile a minute actually uh, in city situations. So there you have it, we're out four, charging a leaf. Okay, now we have increased
increased the uh, limit, went on a joyride, burned off a few electrons, increased the limit to 40 amps, and here you have it, 390 volts, 40 amps going into the leaf battery, which is about, yeah, it's about 16 kilowatts going in, again, data, power, controller, another controller, hardware, and the supply from RAV4 driving this off.